What's up, Jamiroquai? This is Aaron from ATL Sub Home Crew, also Vapors Paradise. And today I have an amazing mod uh, from one of my favorite modders of all time or brands of all time. Um, and that is The Block by Cosmic Innovations. Um, the same people who brought you the Quasar, um, they contracted Vicious Ant. To, to make the Quasar, so uh, a lot of people affiliate, you know, Cosmic Innovations with Vicious Ant, um, but it's not the same thing. <coughs> so, right here, um, I have the block. Um, this is serial number 13, uh, and I'll show you where the serial numbers are in a second. It's pretty, uh, pretty crazy. Uh, it's very well done. I'll show you the internals. Um, obviously, it doesn't come with this brass Quasar or this uh, new solar tip, but uh, I can take that off for you. So, let's go ahead and, oh shit, and uh, break this fucker down. So, <clears throat> this is milled out of a solid block of aluminum, or as the British say, aluminium. And uh, it's fucking heavy, man. Uh, really, really heavy. Uh, brass doors. Um, brass 510 with a copper adjustable pin. And... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you the internals really quickly. Aluminium. Sorry, by aluminium? So, this is the brass door right here, and you'll be able to tell which uh, side to put on because if you look at these holes right here, they're beveled. Um, the other ones are flat, so don't put it on the opposite way. Also, always be careful of threading screws into aluminum because... Uh, <clears throat> it um it strips really easily. Can you pass me a flathead, please. Thanks, bro. So, as you can see, there's no springs. Um, how it works is there's these big, meaty um, flatheads right here, and um, so the threads on here are all buttery. <clears throat> And that's the internals for you right there. Fully mechanical. Now, for people that have seen the Dimitri, it's, you know, kind of similar, um, but it's made by Cosmic Innovations, and Cosmic Innovations is the shit. So, what you do is you would drop your batteries in there, and then you would tighten these, and that way, you know, for different 18650s that are a little bit taller than each other, it will be able to work out. Uh, fully mechanical switch right there. It does look like a Durland switch uh, or a plastic switch, but, you know, uh, that's one of the gripes I had with this mod. I wish it was a big, chunky brass switch, but then, also, you probably would have dealt with your switch getting hot. So, this switch does not get hot. Um, I have noticed uh, that sometimes it won't, it'll be a misfire, but, uh, but you just kind of have to press the button hard. It's not janky in any means. It's just, you know, got to press it a little hard. So I'm going to show you where the serial number is because all it has, it's super clean and it just has an engraving right there that says the block, which is actually a deep laser engraving. I don't know if you can see that in the video, but up in person it is pretty deep. <clears throat> so I'm going to show you where the serial number is. And that's it right there. It says Cosmic Innovations, Manila, Philippines, serial number 13. And you can see all the mill marks from the solid block right there. So the cool thing is, you know, you could rock, you know, if you if you want to bring this thing out, don't really mind it getting scratched up or anything, you could rock this thing without this front door panel. And that way you can kind of show off your serial number and, uh, and have a different look to it, have a more stainless look to it, and then just use the brass, uh, you know, obviously to keep your batteries in. There is a version 2 coming out that uses magnets and also um, uh, I believe from the pictures I've seen that my vendor has been sending me I believe you actually put the batteries through the bottom so I don't think you have to open the door every single time I I'm not 100% sure on that but there is a new version coming out and it will be in black but uh, other than that guys this is the block by Cosmic Innovations if you were lucky enough to get a brass quasar it definitely looks the fucking tits on here. Um, no tits. No tits. Uh, it, it, I mean, it matches perfectly, you know. Um, but yeah, overall, 
if you're into box mods, if you're into parallel box mods, this mod comes highly recommended. Um, it's super, I wish I had a scale here to, uh, to weigh it, but with batteries in it, this thing is hefty. So, uh, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and reassemble this and show you it fully assemble one more time. And like I said, always be careful threading into aluminum. You know, like I said, uh, you don't have to crank down on these screws really tight at all. Yeah. Um, another thing about aluminum, it will pick up surface scratches um, really easily. So you could always rebrush this um, with uh, with Scotch Brite <clears throat> to get that even brush look. You know, uh, if you guys know how to do that, there's YouTube videos for that. But yeah, that's what it looks like fully assembled. Definitely a beautiful design. Um, I would highly recommend picking this one up or checking out the V2 version, which our shop will have here within a couple weeks or a week possibly. But yeah, guys, that is it. The Block by Cosmic Innovations. You guys have a good day. Peace.